Hey everyone, it's Unlikely Hero here, and I'm back with some more Tail Concerto. Now, last time we sorted out Grimtoe, and there was quite a lot of um, cutscene stuff with uh, Flair had been captured, and Cyan was trying to interrogate her, and then, due to his incompetence, she escaped anyway. So I believe once I try and board the airship, I'll get my next mission. Okay. So we're heading to the abandoned factory. And um, I said in the last video that everything from Grimto onwards I don't really remember very well. So, oh, there's the factory. So this could be interesting. I seem to recall there being some quite uh, hard to navigate bits coming up soon. That wasn't very good English, but I mean like with jumping and climbing. Oh yeah, this looks like it might be it actually. <laughs> well, this is fine. It is a bit creepy, isn't it? Can't I just go through here? <laughs> We all knew that was going to be locked, really, didn't we? But it was worth a try. Right, I can see myself dying several times here, so this could be interesting. Okay. Got past the first hurdle. It's fine. Sorry for the brief pause there, I had to take a drink. <laughs> Got, um, unfortunately, I've been suffering a little bit with hay fever, and oh my god. <laughs> and one of the things is, it makes me quite thirsty, it makes my mouth quite dry, so I'm sorry if that kind of hinders me in this video. Oh, okay, I've realised, I have realised. When you spin Waffle around and it's highlighted like that, you can just press X to jump off of it. You don't have to hold any directional button, as far as I can tell, to make him aim for that pipe. He's already aiming for it, so where I was messing up is um, that uh, I was jumping off and then trying to direct him. So I was actually making him turn the wrong way mid-air. <laughs> Which is why I was fooling. Can we just spin around the whole bit? Yeah. <laughs> okay. That wasn't too bad. I was actually trying to catch one of those bombs, but... Ouch. Right, I really need to just not stay still. Ouch. Yeah. I can't do the slappy thing on those, that makes me sad. Ouch. 
I can see myself needing a lot more health items on this level. It looks like those bombs blow up right away anyway, so... Looks like I'm just going ahead. It's actually been about a week since I last played any of this, possibly a bit longer. So um, I'm a bit out of practice, so that's why. I don't know. Ooh. Better be careful. I don't know if I can come up here actually. Okay. That was fine. I had a vague recollection of being able to turn off those valves, so... Does this thing literally just lift up to there? Was that going this whole time? Could I have gone up here without having to use the pipes? Never mind. Oh! This is fine. It's completely fine. Just thought I'd see if there was anything up there, you know. This is, this is going okay, I think. Oh. Treadmills? Um, I kind of feel like I shouldn't go in there. That feels like the end. <laughs> As in, like, the end of Waffle. <laughs> Maybe I should, I don't know. That was exciting, but let's not do that again. Hmm. There's nothing else along there. Can I climb up that pole? That's what I'm wondering. Please just pretend that didn't happen. Hmm. Okay. I don't know if I oh. Okay. I've said before the police robo doesn't immediately stop as soon as you let go of the directional buttons. Yeah, that was a prime example of that. I don't know if I can jump onto that pole. Oh. Oh, okay, this is this is new and something that hasn't happened previously in the game. <laughs> Alright. I don't have any memory of this, unfortunately. Okay. Something sounds... crushy. Oh. Oh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I like panicked as soon as it gave way because I was like, this looks suspicious. Why isn't that bit of treadmill moving? So I was like really on edge and ready. But unfortunately I was a bit too ready and just jumped off of it.
Hmm. It's difficult to... Um, it's probably hard to understand why I'm not jumping properly, but where he's falling a bit, I like can't jump. So I'm just wondering if I ought to... No, that doesn't work. <laughs> okay. Alright. Um... Oh, <laughs> I forgot about that already. <laughs> Terrible. There's no health item here now because I already took it. Okay. Okay. There we go. You know, I think my problem might have been that I was doing this to try and make the distance and it was preventing Waffle from grabbing the ledge, so that wasn't very clever of me. This is quite hard, actually. They shot a bomb at the other kittens. Is that kitten flying? I think there's a kitten stuck in the air just then. It's so cute when they just jump around like that. It's like, oh, these really dangerous members of the Black Cats gang. Oh, helpful, there's arrows. Just in case I get lost, which is likely. Oh, so we've got some more climbing. This should be uh, interesting. I heard a noise just then, but I'm not sure what it was. a bit close. Oh, okay, that's what the noise is. Um, Alright. I can't see where I need to go after that platform, so I'm just going to have to kind of wing it. Oh. Oh, okay. Oh. Yes, mate. This is, this is going surprisingly well. I remember um, the vague memory I have of this level is just having a lot of difficulty with it, um, but it's going really well! <laughs> okay. It's really easy to misjudge that, that jump, um, or I sh those, those jumps I should say. When you're doing this, because he aims automatically once you've spun him round and it's highlighted, it's not really a problem as long as there's no um, none of the steam and um, you jump from high enough and things like that. But when you're jumping, like if I were to jump back onto that pipe now, I do have to kind of control him properly and it's so easy to forget because, because it is different. Bombs, that's nice. This could be interesting. Okay. Ouch. Well that was fine. Ouch. That that wasn't so fine. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Oh, 
<laughs> I really overjumped that one, didn't I? <laughs> Gotta be so careful not to jump too far. I am so focused right now. is so hard. <laughs> Honestly, the difficulty level, it's like it's just gone way up. I was really trying to jump onto that pipe then, I just want you to know that. I'm wondering if I can- What the- what the hell? <laughs> I have no idea why he did that kind of dive thing, like, that was the least helpful thing he could have done. Ugh. Like, I'm not even mad, I'm just confused. <laughs> okay. 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 Not okay. Bad. Not good. Stop. <laughs> it's fine. We'll repair the police robo. We'll get back to it. <laughs> Panther, save me. <laughs> oh good, I'm not like all the way back at the start. I just want it to be known that the controls of this game are quite clunky and the kind of precision that this requires is quite hard to achieve. <laughs> Okay, I am just gonna, like, make a proper run for that platform. And just try and immediately... Yes, goodbye! <laughs> you never take me alive! Oh. Uh-oh. Just pretend that all went really smoothly and it wasn't, like, a pure fluke that I managed to do that little bit. There not be another one of these things. Oh, there is! Ouch. See, if you're right next to it, it can barely do anything to you. But as soon as you've got a little bit of distance, it can actually hit you with the bombs. Oh, those things were... Um, I forgot about them, I don't know how. <laughs> Let us proceed. I might just run around like this. I am hitting them occasionally. I just feel like I need to keep moving, but I say as I stand completely still. <laughs> okay. It's the number of those things. As soon as there's more than one, it's quite a problem. And also, this room is small, and it just... Um, oh, well, I got them all then. Yeah, it's just um, 
having to get around them in such a small space is actually a lot more difficult than it might first appear. Okay. I don't know if there's anything else down here. Top floor. Hello. Better watch out for that shock wave. I vaguely remember this fight, and it is essentially that robot in the middle can't actually do anything. So the only thing to worry about really is the kittens flying around and that uh, uh, wrecking ball, that's the word I'm looking for. I keep mistiming the jump though. I know I could pick up the bombs, but it's actually easier to just do the bubble cannon thing because I that's always available to me. Like and it doesn't um it doesn't require as much concentration if I'm honest. Like running around trying to pick up bombs and making sure the bombs aren't already about to explode. Because I don't want to pick up one that's gonna then explode while I'm holding it, so. Yeah, like I said, the robot in the middle, not a threat at all. Like that poor kitten just sat in it, like, help, help. <laughs> oh, I can't see from here. Let's not stand under the crane. But yeah, there's a little kitten just sat in that robot, even though it can't do anything. He's just sat there, he's gonna get like blown up. Look at him. He's got little beads of sweat coming off of him. <laughs> I feel a bit bad. Okay, so the boss fight was easier than the entire climb here, but you know, that's alright. I'm chilled with that. <laughs> I wonder who that could be. Who are you? Who do you think? Oh yeah, Waffle hasn't actually met him yet. Are you a member of the Black Cats gang? We've just seen him in, in cutscenes, but not not anything that um Waffle wasn't there is what I'm trying to say. <laughs> We're gonna pay. <laughs> Where are you? Come out and show yourself. Hi, babe.
stuck here. Okay, so we follow Fool to the secret base. Um, I have very little recollection of this place either, if I'm honest. Betrayal. Okay, so, um, I think I'm going to leave this episode here because although I don't remember much about this bit, I do remember it being quite difficult. I have a vague recollection of, like, a timed bit, um, and, well, it's not really a secret that I struggle with timed parts in games, I, um, kind of... The little countdown, it just puts me off a little bit. I'm sure a lot of you understand that. <laughs> um, yeah, so I think I am going to leave this episode here. So, yeah. So next time, I suppose, I'll have to try and pursue Fool through this secret base and find him in his study, as he said. <laughs> Was he waiting for me in the study for? Yeah, so I'll um, hunt down Fool in the next episode, I think, because I'm not sure how long that bit will take, and this is already a reasonably long episode. Not as long as some of the others, but it's decent, I think. So I'll do it next time. Alright. I'll see you then. Bye. <laughs>